Roberto Monaco here with Influenceology, and we are finalizing our event, Influencing from the Front program. We teach professionals how to use public speaking presentations and storytelling to advance their careers. And today's a presentation day, which is awesome, where the attendees have an opportunity to deliver a talk and get coaching feedback. Now, because we spend all day Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and we cover a lot of information, I always like to give some tips on how the attendees can maximize this class and keep develop these skills. I developed this formula called the four S's. So the number one S is structure. Now, as a professional presenter, communicator, leader, I realized in my career that structure gives you freedom. So any presentation that you do, one minute presentation, five minute presentation, one hour webinar, 10 minute keynote, 90 minute keynote, there's always a structure from opening, pre-frame, body, pre-close and close. And that structure has many, many, many different uh, variations. So the best communicators, either consciously or unconsciously, they have mastered a sequence or a presentation structure. The second S stands for story. Facts tell, stories sell. Now, a lot of people confuse sometimes. They go, well, what's your story? What's the story you're gonna tell? And they basically, they think, well, I'm gonna put a bunch of slides and a bunch of bullet points, and that's my story. The truth is that that's not storytelling. Now, storytelling goes beyond public speaking presentations because you can use it in writing as well. But the idea here is that we all have stories in our lives that you can use to help frame or illustrate uh, points that you want to communicate. And one of the most powerful things that the attendees can do after the your class is to develop a storytelling database. Because as a professional, every single day you're going to communicate. And if you want to make those points more powerful and you want to connect your audience to the highest level possible, then you want to add stories to presentation, right? So the first S stands for structure, presentation structure. The second S stands for storytelling. The third S stands for state, your emotional state. Uh, some people struggle with the fear of the uncertainty, nervousness, down anxiety. Some people struggle uh, of, they're just very monotone, they don't have passion to present. So cultivating a state of excitement, of passion, of purpose throughout your career is really, really, really important. I've seen so many people that sometimes they, they have no problem communicating when speaking to groups or from a camera, but they, they're not associated with the state of why they're speaking, right? So it's really, really important. And during our class, we cover so many different exercises on how to do that. And the fourth S is simple. Say yes, right? Say yes to presentation opportunities. Uh, I believe that there's no such thing as a shortcut success, really doesn't, but if there's one thing that's going to speed up your career or your business is your capacity to speak to groups. Why? Because number one, there's a lot of people who don't like doing it. And number two, the ones who do it, they don't get training, so they don't do a good job in my perspective. And I go to conferences all over the world, all year round for 21 years, and I see presenters on stage that they could be 10, 20, 30 times better, but they never took the time to learn and develop their skills. So number one, again, cultivate and learn about presentation structure. Number two, uh, become a master storyteller. Organize your stories, have a storytelling database. Number three, create this very powerful state of mind, right? Before your presentations. And the, the fourth S is say yes to presentation opportunities. Don't speak to inform, speak to transform. And I see you at our next Influencing from the Front.